Today's video is sponsored by Hexbug. Special delivery for Evan Storm. Let's open this up, Stormers. What do you all think is inside? One hour later. There's been a reactor explosion at the Newport power plant. We need to go in and secure the area. Does everybody understand? <laughs> now move out. Sir, the Geiger counter is picking up extremely high levels of radiation. It's clear over here. I'm not seeing anything over here. Wait a minute. Looks like something spilled out of this barrel. Looks like it's glowing. All right, man, be very cautious. There's something fishy going on here. Did you guys hear that? There's something over there. What was that noise? I've spotted something. I'm not sure what it is. I think it's moving. It's coming right for me.
plan. We need help now. Do you copy over? Ah, uh, no way. I know what this is. It's Jump Bot. Here's the front of the box. It's the factory collection. It says new port power plant. Power up your builds. Includes one right white module and one drive module. Deconstruct, reconstruct pipe system. Three robots included. 285 pieces. Dismantle the pipe to make new designs for your bots. Chomp, Matt, and Messy. There's a secret build inside. Step one, cut the ceiling open. Wow. Step two, punch out the window. Step three, punch out this window. What's inside? What's that green stuff? Look at all those pipes. Is it a nuclear reactor? Some of these pipes are broken. What's look in this window? Pump house, authorized personnel only. I don't see anything in there. It's time to tear down the wall. What is this stuff? This looks like a centrifuge. Used to rich uranium-235. These are plutonium control rods. These are seam pipes. They look damaged. These crates are full of nuclear waste. What's in this maintenance room? I don't see anything. This is weird. This looks like a flux capacitor. These are used for time travel. This is a construction truck bucket. What's in here? What's open the other side? This is the pump house. Let's open the door and see what's inside. Looks like someone lost a broom head. Let's take out these nuclear waste storage containers. I'm not sure what this is. It might be a white condenser. This looks like an electric supercharger engine. More junk is everywhere. This is some kind of flexible polymeric tubing. Here's a chain with a link attachment. Let's try and get it off. This is a gear. Here's a pipe wrench. Not sure what this is. There's something in here. Let's take a look. More junk. Let's see what's inside this generator. Tires, wheels, what else? Another orange bucket. Time to break down all the pipe. These pipes are used to move steam and water. The water cools the reactor and the reactors produce steam. The steam then powers turbines that produce energy in the form of electricity. We need to be very careful. 
This looks like a fuel rod. Here's the last box. What is this? I think it's a Stargate. What a mess. Let's see what we can turn this junk into. This is my junk bot, Nessie. My favorite part is its head. I use the white condenser as it can fire white rays. This is what Nessie looks like after installing a gamma white array. This scary looking junk bot is chomp. My favorite part is its hydraulic jaw crusher. Champ looks really cool with a gamma white array hooked up. This junk bot is max. It doesn't get mad, it gets even by using its Stargate superconductor that I use for its body. This is max with the gamma white array attached. Okay. This is the robot fork with that I built with the pipes. I used the electric supercharged engine that I found. It also has a working fork with. It can go forward and backwards. It can carry material and even transport personnel. Thanks Hexbug for sending us these really cool junk bots. Bye Stormers!